Thank you so much. So Oscar night brought us lots of memorable moments, some great fashion as well. And uh, we have extra correspondent, North Texas native Rachel Lindsay standing by because she is always the girl to recap it all for us. Okay, <laughs> so how was it? What'd you think? I, first of all, the red carpet wasn't red. What in the world? <laughs> it was champagne. And it was it was very on theme. I don't know if they do this did this on purpose or they just understood what, how people were going to be dressed. But that kind of went along with the trends that we saw for the fashion uh, last night: black, white, champagne, metallic. Some of those nude blush tones. Uh, sparkles were a big theme. Oh. So yeah, Oscar setting the trend. I gotta say, I love the champagne carpet. Okay, I know Bring some. I know some of your colleagues um, talked to a couple of the eventual winners, and, and they were so humble. I mean, take a listen. Mm -hmm. I decided to look like an Oscar in case I don't win one. But seriously, I thought if there's a pretty picture of me dressed like an Oscar, yes. that's sort of second to winning one. How do we describe this moment, sir? Overjoyed. Really happy to be here. This is a nice reunion. I think it's been since 2003 or five that I was at the Oscars. I'm rooting for everyone in all their categories. I can't pick a favorite, but um, I'm just glad to be here for the show. No, Mike, there we go. Now to fashion. Okay, so Rihanna, I mean Rihanna, hello, hello. We have her, her picture. Let's pull it up. I no. know. No, Rihanna. I don't know. Every what do we have? Everyone was waiting for Rihanna to come to the carpet. She was the last one to walk the carpet. Of course, social media went crazy. Everyone on the carpet went crazy. She looked absolutely stunning when she arrived. That photograph right there was from her performance of Lift Me Up, which she sounded right. absolutely incredible. Uh, but on the carpet, she wore kind of a chocolate leather band dress over a, a bodysuit, jersey bodysuit, showing off her her pregnant belly which she looked absolutely glowing she had kind of a brown and yellow diamond jewelry on and also kind of an orangey brown diamond uh, diamond ring yes. she was glowing she did not have asap rocky with her but i did peep him in the audience during her performance oh interesting interesting okay hallie <laughs> bailey the little mermaid star not hallie fairy which can be confusing let's take a look at hers Ooh, i love that beautiful she looks like she's floating on water we know that they showed the little mermaid trailer an extended version during the show i mean swimming she's ethereal she's floating she's totally embodying ariel and i mean we all want to be a part of her world nailed it nailed it what about <laughs> angela bassett Angela Bassett looking so regal and giving us queen vibes in that beautiful royal purple. She's wearing Moschino. You see she's got the jewels to match it, that exaggerated bow on her shoulder. Yet she, when Angela Bassett just walks up to you, you just feel, you. it's one of those <laughs> things you lift your shoulders up yes. in her because you understand the greatness that's in front of you. I can I can understand that. This was my favorite, um, uh, Cara Delevingne. Um, that red, this red dress right here. Look at this. Woo! Look at that slit. No one That's was a slit, girl. It. That slit. She had that platform red heel to match. The exaggerated shoulder again. The jewels on her neck. She was wearing Ellie Saab. And I have to tell you, we were continuing to see black and white and metallic. And then boom. Here comes Cara Delevingne looking absolutely stunning. Her hair slicked back, the smoky eye, the carrots around her neck, 62.85. 62.85, exactly. That's wow. choker around her neck. Yeah, she, she was definitely one of our favorites for the night. Yeah, so awesome. My sisters got to go last night. Both of my sisters were there, Rachel. I, where was my invite? Hello. I would be... <laughs> So upset if those were, I, I have two sisters, so I'd be so upset if that was me. I know, I know. All right, you can see extra weeknights at 6.30 here on Fox 4. Good to see you, Rachel. Always good to see you, too.